Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I just wanted to do a little haul. I don't know if you would consider a little haul, like there's not that many products here, but they're quite pricey products. So I'll start out with my Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick. And I got these three colours. I do have two other colours, but I didn't purchase them recently. They're more from a while ago, like when they first came out. So the new colours that I got are Posh Spice and I'll swatch them on my hand for you as well because they all look pretty similar in the tubes but they are quite different, I think. Okay, so that's Posh Spice. So it's like a nudie grey type colour, like it's got a grey tone to it but it's not grey, but it's a grey beige. So that's that one. Uh, this one is I'm Nude and it's quite a light nude. I tried it quickly on my lips. It's a really nice colour. All these colours are really nice which is why I chose them. So that one is I'm Nude. And then the last one which I'm actually wearing on my lips is Celebrity Skin. And I absolutely love this colour. It's the perfect nude shade. So I'll swatch that next to that those colours as well so you can see the difference. So as you can see, this is more of a warm nude. Then you have the really light nude and then you have the cool tone nude. So they do look quite similar in the tubes, but then on your hand or lips or whatever, they are quite different. So I'm really happy with these purchases. I think they're great quality. They don't feel drying on the lips at all. You can see that my lips do have quite a lot of cracks in them, but that is because I generally have pretty dry lips. But um, it doesn't feel super, super drying. It just feels really comfortable and it's got a really nice finish and I really, really like them. Okay, so since we're talking about liquid lipsticks, MAC recently came out with their own line of uh, liquid lipsticks. Oop, sorry. So these are the colours here. I got four of them. I did want more, but as I said, they are quite pricey, as you know MAC is. So these are the four colours that I chose, and I have not tried these on my lips yet. And the packaging is quite cute. It's a bit different. Um, it's got the original MAC lids that are on the lipsticks, um, but then it's got the coloured tube as you can see. So I'll start with this shade, um, and this shade is Lady Be Good, and that's a nude colour. I just had to get a nude colour because I love my nudes. So this one is Lady, Lady Be Good, and it's just a peachy nude colour. Then I'll try this colour for you, and this one is Too Matte With Love. Wow. Super pigmented. And it's a gorgeous colour. A super bright pink. And then we have O Lady. Yeah. O Lady, yeah. And this is like a bright purple. Ooh. It's kind of dark but kind of bright. I can't really explain it. But that's what it looks like there. If my camera will focus. Yep. Really nice purple. Can't wait to try these actually. And I think I might actually do a lip swatch video for these. So stay tuned for that. Then I have this colour here which is the darkest one I got. And this one's called High Drama. So this is a really dark vampy purple. Kind of similar to O Lady, but it's O Lady is slightly lighter. So that one is High Drama. As you can see, it is slightly darker than um what's it called? O Lady, I think. I keep forgetting what the names are. Yeah, O Lady. <laughs> so yeah, they're the four colours that I got from MAC. Super excited to try those. I can't really give you any reviews on it because I don't know how it 
it feels on the lips or how it lasts. So yeah, this is more of just a haul video it's showing you what I have purchased recently. And I haven't done one of these in so long. I didn't actually purchase this, I got this as a gift on Christmas. So this is the MAC Copper Lux Velux Pearl Fusion Eyeshadow and I was super excited to, to receive this as a Christmas gift because I think it's absolutely gorgeous. These colors are right up my alley and I just love them so much. Thank you so much, Dorothy. You know me well, girl. <laughs> Okay, and now moving on to another gift that I have received for Christmas. And this gift is from my beautiful mum. And I'm so happy that she got it for me because I, ever since I saw it, I was like, oh my god, I want that. So it is the, sorry about the flashback or whatever you want to call it. Um, this is the Hourglass Holiday Palette or something. Like, it was a holiday collection palette or something like that. I don't know. But it is the Hourglass palette with all the little uh, ambient lighting powders and the blushes. So, I've tried it. I haven't tried all of the shades, I don't think. Um, so, I used this as a bronzer actually today. So, this one here. And I love that it's so soft and it just blends into the skin really beautifully. And I actually have this shade here as a highlight. So it's really subtle. It's not like Mary Lou highlight or anything like that. But it is really beautiful. And I love the packaging. It's so pretty. Except that you get fingerprints all over it. And now the next thing I purchased, I went to Mecca because my boyfriend got me a gift card for Christmas. And I thought I would try a few things that I've heard people talk about but haven't really tried any of the products and that is NARS so I got three things by NARS and the first thing I got was the NARS creamy concealer in custard and I'm wearing it today and I have tried it before today as well and I absolutely love this concealer it does not crease on me and it just gives a really nice coverage and it covers up my dark circles and I feel like it really brightens up underneath my eyes as well. So that is a really great product and it does live up to the hype, I think so. And the next thing I got is a NARS lipstick and I've heard so much about these. I've heard they're really, really good. I didn't get the matte one. This one's like a glossy sort of shiny finish one. I'm not sure what they're called, but it's in the color Cruising. And it's just a really natural nude shade. I wanted a really natural everyday shade. So I'll just swatch that for you. So it just looks like that. It's very creamy and very shiny um, and glossy on the lips, which I like. So that is Cruising by NARS. And then the last thing I got from NARS is a little eyeshadow. And... This is the Dual Intensity Eyeshadow, and it's called Dion, I think. It's spelled D-I-O-N-E. Ooh. Oh, how cute. <laughs> and um, it looks like that. It's such a gorgeous shade. It's really pearly and... Oh, actually, no. It's really metallic, actually. So I'll just swatch that for you. So it looks like that. How beautiful is that? I cannot wait to use this. So pigmented. Look at that. That was one swatch with my finger. That's crazy. That's absolutely beautiful. I might get more of those because it's so gorgeous. So that is a that. Absolutely love that. So happy I got it. Okay, and now moving on to some purchases that I made from Anastasia Beverly Hills and I made this purchase online and first of all I got a 8 well palette and I bought some individual eyeshadows I'm sorry they are not in color order like they're just all over the place I just popped them in wherever so I'm sorry for, for you um OCD freaks out there <laughs> so the first color I got was fudge and these just clip in like magnetic like the makeup geek and the z palette they've got magnetic um backings to them 
And so fudge is a beautiful warm chocolate brown color, like a fudge color, which the name suggests. And then this really nice forest green color is called peacock and it's so pretty. I think this is um, from her metallic line, like she just came out with new eyeshadows and these are some of them. Actually, I think all of these are new, the ones that I got. And the next shade is chiffon and it's like a golden bronzy shade really pretty I'm actually wearing that on my eyes today even fudge and peacock so I did film this look that I created today so if you want to see that stay tuned to my channel make sure you subscribe so that you're updated when that goes up and the next shade I got is chocolate crumble and I'm not sure why it's called chocolate crumble because it's quite purple but it's a beautiful color nonetheless and then I got this shade which is called lace and it's more matte it's more matte than the other colors the other colors are really like shiny and um, metallic -y looking but this one's more matte or satiny whatever you want to call it and I use this as a like um, like putting it over my eyeshadow base so my eyeshadow base isn't tacky and the next color I got is henna and this is so beautiful I'm wearing it on my bottom lash line it's just a really pretty um, coppery orangey shade so pretty and then the next color here is macaroon and this is a beautiful uh, metallic purple color you can see my finger print in it because I did swatch it and then the last color which is also a purple shade if I can get it out and this one's called Electro and I'm super excited to try this I almost used this on my bottom lash line today but I wanted to use the copper color but I am super excited to try this um, so stay tuned once again subscribe to my channel to see those videos so yeah, that is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And then the last thing, which is like the end of the haul and the last thing from Anastasia Beverly Hills is the glow kit. You guys, are you serious? Like I was not expecting it to be this big. I thought it was just going to be like a little, little square palette, but it is actually really huge. It's legit. And I love the packaging, the colour, it's so pretty and different compared to their normal black packaging. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Are you serious? Like, I think these pop out too, I didn't really check. <gasps> they pop out. Maybe you can buy them individually. I don't know if you can, but ah, that's awesome that they pop out. Okay, I actually haven't tried these, but they just look so amazing in the palette. Guys, come on. Okay, so this color here is called Bubbly. This color here is called Dripping in Gold. And this color here is called Sunburst. And this color here is Golden Bronze. So, you have every color that would suit all different types of skin tones so this is a really good palette for makeup artists I think I might actually swatch the colors on my hand for you today I actually want to see how they look as well and how shiny and pigmented they are so I'm gonna start out with sunburst which is the yellowy the more yellow shade out of the palette Wow Gorgeous. Obviously you wouldn't apply it to your face this strongly. I mean, if you want to, go for it, but you know, just so you can get an idea of what they look like. So that's Sunburst. Oh, so we've got itchy nose. Okay, now I'm going to go in with Golden Bronze. So pretty. This one's more of a bronze. 
a bronze highlight. I don't know if my camera is focusing. I know it's focusing on my face, but I want it to focus on my hand. So that's golden bronze. Now I'm going to go in with bubbly, which seems to be the colour that I would probably gravitate to the most. Dripping in gold and bubbly look quite similar, but we'll see once I swatch them. Yeah, so this one's like a champagne light colour, which is the colours that I tend to gravitate towards most when I'm using a highlighter. It actually looks kind of pinky next to the drippy, the golden bronze one. Okay, and now I'll try the dripping in gold. So pigmented. Yeah, so this one's uh, more golden than bubbly. Bubbly's more pinky. You can see a slight pink tone to it. And then with dripping in gold, you can see that it's more bronzy colored. So those are the shades there. How beautiful. I cannot wait to try these bad boys. So excited. So yeah, that is the end of my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and please leave in the comments if you like haul videos and if you'd like to see more from me. I mean, not that I'm shopping all the time, but if I do ever go shopping, I will do a haul. I know I said that I would do more fashion hauls, but um, yeah, I'm not really good at those. Um, so I still will try to do them more often, but yeah, anyways, I'm rambling now. I will see you guys in my next video.